He's been grazing our screens for quarter of a century, talking about tyres of all things. That suave, smooth Aussie Vince Martin is a legend in this country, but relatively unknown everywhere else. Green Ambler caught up with him and discovered Vince thought the 25-year gig was going to be a once -er. Action. G'day. It's a hit, all right. Bow repairs, clean, cosy waiting rooms. Come in, sit down, have a cup of tea or coffee, read a magazine, and let us do the dirty work. A sneak preview of the latest Bow Repairs ad, and its smooth-talking Aussie star is filming it right here in central Wellington. He's different from what we see on TV. Um, like, you know, when he's in person with you, he's not so tall, but... <laughs> G'day. I'm Vince Martin and some lucky customer who buys... 25 years ago, the Aussie actor and singer auditioned for a little tyre company ad that was only to be shown in New Zealand. And then about seven, eight months later, I got a phone call saying, God, these ads have really taken off here. Can you come over and do a... There was a show called Fair Go. I said, you know, you're huge here. I actually didn't believe it. Vince. Until I got off the plane. It was like, wow. Hey, Vince, hey, Vince. <laughs> There's no doubt about it. Vince has got them palpitating in Papakura and writhing in Remuera. He's sexy, all right. His ads certainly appealed to women. One from Invercargill even held a mock marriage with his cardboard cutout. They've made you into a kind of a sex symbol, haven't they? Have they? <laughs> Have they really? <laughs> this old guy? Oh, well, I, don't, I don't know about that. Here comes, here comes the first event. He was born Vincent Marcus Stein and changed his name when he was 19 on the insistence of his agent. And I was a little shocked really and um, I'm very nervous about telling my parents. It was actually my mother that came up with the idea of Martin. She wrote out our full family name and started removing letters and came up with, with Martin. He's done a bit of acting. Yeah, but where are we? Somewhere over the Pacific Ocean. Ha <laughs> ha you pilots, you're funny. But it's the ads that have made him famous here. I come here for 10 days and it's all five-star craziness and then I go home and I'm a nobody again. That's great. <laughs> it must be quite strange being so well-known here and not anywhere else. It is. Um, although I, I live in New York and I like not being that well-known <laughs> in New York. Um, it's, quite a, it's quite overwhelming when I come here sometimes. And... Um, a lot of people actually think that they really know you. I mean, I've been at a restaurant here, and all of a sudden someone just pulls up a chair and sits at the table. Says, good day, Vince. How are you, mate? Silver bells, silver bells, silver bells. Silver bells. It's Christmas time in the city. Did you actually sing in those? Yeah, that was me, yeah. The, the Christmas ads, yeah. That was me singing, yeah. That's not really the type of stuff I sing in New York City. But, uh, yeah, that was me. What do you sing? Jazz. Jazz and blues. Is it too early in the morning to give me a little sample? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's quarter to three. He has quite a following as a lounge singer in New York. These days he's given away the acting for his first love, music. While he's happy in the Big Apple for now, he can see himself ending up in this part of the world. I love the South Island. I would like to buy property there and maybe retire one day, get myself a boat and, uh, and end up here. For now, he's just going to have to settle for shooting an ad here every couple of years. To get someone like that to come into my store and take a few photos of us and the guys and do an ad in our store, and it's something to be proud of. Every year I think it's over. I do. Um, you're mad if you don't think that, otherwise you're going to be spending the money before you get it. Um, but... Uh, I'm always relieved when I get the call. Are you going to get him to change a tyre? <laughs> we'll give him a challenge, eh? Can you actually change a tyre? Of course I can. <laughs> of course I can. Of course I can. 